Hey, I am back in this game, as you see here, Rage Chicken 2. So, yesterday, I recorded part one of this. So today, obviously, I'm going to do part two. I was uh, trying to record for 30 minutes before I started this one, but I, I got, like, really stuck at a part, so I just stopped the recording altogether until I, until I finished it. I didn't make that much progress from... The start of this recording to the ending of the the last one you guys didn't miss much don't worry if you're thinking you missed a lot you really didn't i just skipped like maybe like a couple places yeah so we're back in rage chicken don't fall into this because that is death what does that say hags have a great summer that's what that says it's clearly what that says i think it I think that's supposed to be a G, so it definitely says Hags. All right. Good. Oh, great. It's another one of these ones going up like this. Oh, I see. Okay. Oh. You think I'm not up to the challenge? <laughs> you fool. I've done this before. Just not this particular area, Ray. Oh, I sense something in the air right here. I saw, like, some particles or, or something. Uh-oh. Oh, I know. Ah, so I'm supposed to jump up here. Ooh. Okay, I'll get back up there, and I will try that once again. So it wants me to jump up there. I see what I gotta do now. I see, I see. I am going up these stairs. Ooh. Oh, jeez, there's some more up here. Aha! Ah, crap. All right, let's make sure this tank doesn't blast me to shreds if I jump up what you mainly do, which is a little strange when you think about it. Level three. So All right. Generally quite inhospitable to life. No idea what you're talking about. You were reasonable, but the blue star is something to be endured rather than enjoyed. There was a good chance that some of your ancestors died because it was too cold, and maybe they like snow too. Do you like snow? Uh, it's snowing outside right now, actually. As a matter of fact, it just started snowing today. Sign of winter coming, even though it's still fall, but, you know. I'm supposed to get up here somehow? What? Okay, I guess that is how you get up here. Alright, now I gotta figure out... Oh. You jump on that, of course, of course. Well, that makes it a little easier to get a... Okay, I said a little easier, I didn't say completely easy, but... It makes it... Po I should say it makes it possible to get on the top of this telephone pole now. Oh. Okay. I actually got over it. Holy crap. I was not... Ex I don't know why I wasn't expecting to get over it. Oh, you're gonna give me another hard one in the... Soviet place? Where am I? I'm in some sort of barrel. I'm going to Chernobyl, guys. It is a field trip. I don't think that would be a very good field trip. If... It, it, if you're taking, like, a, a Russian class, be like, how to speak Russian? Alright, class, we're going to Chernobyl. We're going to learn to speak Russian. And also, we're going to learn to speak Mutinamese as well. Because you're going to get uranium up your butt. Maybe you wondered what happened to the first chicken. No, I don't care Maybe what happened. happened to the first chicken. I, I don't care. I... Now you got me thinking about it. Is chickens only come through eggs, but if... There had to be a first chicken, so then how did it get here? Was it... It would have had to come from an egg from another animal, but the chicken evolved from this other animal's egg. Thus began the chicken. There. A theory solved. I'm a genius. Why am I in a nuclear weapons arsenal right now? I don't think a chicken belongs here. This is Chernobyl. I freaking knew it. Oh, ho, 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 Oh, my God. I couldn't be closer. I am on top of the ice, and I am not falling. I am the luckiest chicken in this whole game right there. I did not fall. I was directly on top of the snow, but the Ginker is like, Ah, you know what? I want you to complete the game, so I'm going to not screw you over as much. I'm still going to do it, but just not as much. Oh, my. Look, he's doing it again. He's, I'm literally floating. Not a pixel of this chicken is touching that. This is amazing. This is the work of the Illuminati. <laughs> Dude, what the heck? 
fairness, yeah. <laughs> the snowman be dressed as the Soviets with a bucket. All right. Uh, I'm down here. Cool. All right. I. Oh, oh my God. I didn't think I was going to be fighting the Soviets in this game. Or at least Soviet snowmen, but you know, that's just how Chernobyl be. It creates Soviet snow, an army of Soviet snowmen, obviously. Imagine actually falling into one of these holes right here. That would be the actual worst thing ever. If you actually fell into one of those, then you're just like down a, an entire level. Oh, God. That is enough. Just another trash pile. I am on that top of the so trash pile. Trash. It is. Mostly in places that you can't see. Maybe these trash piles even look the same to you. But they are all toxic in their own unique way. Oh yeah, I forgot this is Chernobyl. So he, he is correct about the toxicity. It's actually dangerous. I shouldn't even be in this general vicinity of Chernobyl. Seems like I'm entering a new... This is a Level. hidey garage for moments when you don't want to hide your vehicles outside. Oh, okay. Alright, sure. I'll go with that. Wait, hide your vehicles outside. Where would you- wait, where would you hide your vehicle outside? What? You like parking in, in all the grass? Is that why? Hiding them in like a, a, a paddy field or something? What are you talking about? Okay, so I just looked on the achievements to see what they're like what if when i got those level ones if that means i completed them or if i or if that's what i made it to but when i get those it means i completed those levels so i only saw five level achievements meaning that th th this is the last level it should be because i did not see like a level six meaning if I can complete this in the next hour, this level, I should be able to complete the game. Which I'm going to try to do. But I'm going to struggle, of course. I'm supposed to go this way, me. I'm supposed to go this way. It's hollow, me. I'm supposed to go this way, me. Jeez, me. Not paying attention. Look, do I made it. like a challenge with no reward? I, no. That's... I like a challenge with a reward, not without a reward. Otherwise, I have no obligation to do the challenge. Like, if there's literally no reward, even if it's just like a mental reward of like, ha, I'm better than you, then there's literally no reason to do it. Not even if it's going to like benefit my own mental state. I don't know what to say. Uh, yeah, whatever. We'll just go with what I said. Yeah. Nope, not going to do it. Anyway, what, what the heck am I doing on top of here now? I'm going to stay on top of these and, like, not fall to the ground because I feel like uh, this game's taught me better than to just fall to the ground at any given time. Like, I'm supposed to do this. Aha. Uh -huh. Oh, look at that. Oh, this is going to be hard. Oh, maybe not. Yes. Okay. Don't fall to the ground, me. This is like the, the, the thing from the Incredibles movie. With that, that big giant ball thing? That's exactly what this looks like. Who just dumps these gigantic piles of trash at random places? And also, this army truck is in trash? What? Also, there's a floating chair up there, apparently. Wait. Hold on a minute. Hang on. There's. I saw something down here. Hang on a minute. I saw like something flashing right here yellow. But it's gone now. Okay, I am starting to see stuff. This radiation is getting to me, man. I'm starting to see things. Oh, God. And I made it onto the chair. Okay, now I gotta do magic and not fall to my death. Oh. Holy. together in groups can make trash production far more efficient. Okay. And efficiency is good, right? Well, I don't... Trash production is not necessarily a hobby that people should take up. Trash cleanup would be a better one, but not trash production itself. That's a bad hobby. <laughs> what happens when... I mean, how much trash can garbage fills take? I never thought to ask that question. I'm going over here now. I'm flying over... What the... I'm going to space? <gasps> oh, my 
It's like you put it in just for me. <laughs> oh man, we're going to space, everyone. Oh my god, we're going to space. This is great. This is the greatest game. Well, actually, maybe Universal Sandbox is pretty cool, I guess. But for at the moment, I guess this is a great game. Some of the harder challenges in life are completely optional. I don't think that's true. Okay, well, it could be true. I thought he was going to say more, but otherwise, all right. Yeah, sure. You go ahead with, with that statement, sir. Jeez, I thought I was going to go a lot lower there. No, that was not as bad as I thought it would be. Oh my god, is this the end of the game? I'm into the top of this tower, and now I all I have to do is go in here and press this. You completed the tutorial. What? This is just practice mode. <laughs> the real challenge lies ahead. Oh god. I hope that's actually not true. If this... That better not have been just tutorial. That took... Three and a half hours-ish. Is this... Is this the end? Pekita. Oh, so that's the... Russian rocket that we're taking is Pekita. Oh, hello black holes. Or angry black holes. I was eaten. Okay. Oh. I did it. I am a genius. That's literally the end. Life can be very difficult sometimes. Okay, now I'm, I'm that's kind of anticlimactic. I was expecting something more <laughs> to, towards that 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 end. You purposely did that to <laughs> The to make people feel mad. It's like, just one last nice. piece of rage you had to add in there. Just, ah, oh, seriously, I did the, all this for that? Are you serious? Yeah, you, that's exactly why you did that ending like that. It was one last piece of rage. You just had to do it. Well, that is Rage Chicken 2. Oh, I, yeah, Rodney. That is who I am. I remember saying that at the beginning. Oh, I'm going to forget that name. And I sure did. Now I know it that I'm back here. Rodney. Alright, where's the cheat codes? Do I get the cheat codes? Alright, well. I should probably tell you this now. What I, How I didn't spend seven hours playing this. So, Mr. Game Creator. I'm going to tell you something. Might make you rage a little bit. When you, ever you click exit, yes, you save. But the thing is, if you do Alt F4... The game doesn't save, and then when you reload it, it goes back to whatever position you were, you last saved in. That's how I saved myself seven hours playing this game and made it go down to three and a half. Yeah, I, I discovered that yesterday in like the middle of the recording. I'm like, here's an idea. What happens if I Alt F4? Then I rejoin it, reload up the game, and then boom. Where I last saved, that's where I was. I use that a lot, just so you know, dude. That's gonna make you mad. Probably like at least like a hundred times doing this. It saved me so much goddamn time. Because there's no way <laughs> this game is made. <laughs> I would not complete it in this video. And I would have lost my sanity doing it all over again. Because, oh boy, there are some areas where I could not for the life of me figure it out. It took me like 5 to 15-ish minutes to figure it out. Five. To 20, maybe even 25, I'm not even sure at this point. But, geez, yeah. And if I had to do that over again, just keep going up and then, ooh, no, I failed. Oh, up and ooh, oh, 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 over and over. I would have lost my sanity, which I guess this is why it, that's what this game is about. But, you know, at the same time, I want to actually finish it, have fun, and record a couple of videos where I actually complete it. So, yeah, that's Rage Chicken 2. If you want to download the game, you can either get it on Steam or you can get it on itch.io. His itch.io username is cultofmidi.itch.io, which is actually his Discord username as well, so I guess that makes sense. If you go to his, either, I don't know if you can like comment on Steam. Steam's all weird. It doesn't have like a proper commenting. I think you can start like a discussion post, but there's not like a single comment feature. It's you know, Steam's weird. It, it's not normal. But on itch that I know, I know you can just do normal comments. So if you go and buy it, tell them that I sent you 
in the, to use my non-existent creator code for a game that doesn't have a feature for entering creator codes. My creator code is add a freaking creator code. TUD. Alright, good. Thank you all for watching. Get this vid a like game. Go subscribe for much more. Comments I don't ignore. And post notifications.